We don't always consider how we occasionally pause movies to look something over more closely, or to point out to a friend something amusing or interesting that nobody else has noticed. However, it turns out that pausing movies isn't as uncommon as we thought. In fact, many people are coming forward and admitting, either proudly or shamefully, to having to stop for a closer look. Check to see if you're a member of this club and if any of these movies made you want to hit the pause button. Wild Things, an American neo-noir crime film released in 1998, grossed $67.2 million at the box office. It rose to prominence due to its more explicit scenes than was common in the mainstream. In the film, actresses Nev Campbell and Denise Richards share a passionate kiss in a pool. As a result, many viewers couldn't help but keep pressing the pause button. One of the most iconic and provocative scenes in film history can be found in Basic Instinct. This neo-noir erotic thriller grossed $352 million worldwide, making it the fourth highest grossing film of 1992. Sharon Stone was outstanding in the film, and this scene overshadowed the entire production. It's because Stone's character appears to be fully dressed, and then her leg crossover gives viewers far more than they expected before watching the film. 1982's Fast Times at Ridgemont High is unquestionably a classic 80s coming-of-age film. It featured early appearances by several actors who went on to become well-known, including Forrest Whitaker, Nicolas Cage, Anthony Edwards, and Eric Stoltz. The home viewers enjoyed several excellent performances, but they were unable to resist pausing at one particular sequence. In the scene, Linda, played by Phoebe Cates, goes swimming with her buddy Stacy. The most paused part, though, is when Linda ascends the stairs out of the pool. The majority of you might have seen Fight Club and adored it. Released in 1999, we bet you didn't notice a point in the movie where Brad Pitt's character is briefly shown to us but not fully introduced. Finding that scene is a challenge because he is just in one frame, and even if you blink, you'll miss it. In Star Wars, A New Hope, from 1977, there is one sequence that viewers keep rewinding and replaying. One of the stormtroopers in the scenario unintentionally knocks their head on the doorframe as they pass through the entrance. We are thrilled that the moment, which miraculously made it into the final cut, did. Fans absolutely adore this humorous moment. Alfred Hitchcock's 1960 American psychological horror movie, Psycho, made a big impression on the horror genre. Anthony Perkins, who played the spooky Norman Bates, gave a standout performance, turning this movie into a masterpiece. You already know how the movie ends if you have seen it. As the story comes to a close, Norman Bates is apprehended and sent to jail. The sequence that causes spectators to pause the most occurs when Bates looks into the camera and, for a split second, a skull can be seen covering his eerie face. Boogie Nights, from 1997, by Paul Thomas Anderson has a very distinctive subject matter. In the film, Dirk Diggler, played by Mark Wahlberg, is a wannabe adult movie star who starts to change into someone else. Despite the fact that several sequences required viewers to pause, there was one scene in particular that required practically everyone to do so. In the moment, Diggler strips off his shirt in front of the cast, allowing viewers to glimpse what was hidden beneath. Do you recall Sid, the wicked child who enjoys dismembering toys? He imprisons Buzz and Woody in the original Toy Story, 1995. Sid appeared in Toy Story 3 as a garbage man, although only ardent series viewers spotted this. Sid was cruel to everyone, thus it seems like an appropriate conclusion for such a bad child. There are those who adore it and those who detest it. But there is no denying that the Martin Scorsese movie, Wolf of Wall Street, takes a lot of chances. Margot Robbie teases Leonardo DiCaprio in one of the sequences to the point that spectators can't get enough of the passionate scene. If you haven't seen the movie, watch it right away, then come back later and leave a comment on what you thought. That's it for our quick video today, but thanks for taking time to like, subscribe, and share our video. Until next time, have a great day.